going on guys we're gonna try something a little different this time uh, we're here at market one in Clearwater Florida we're about to head 80 miles out into the Gulf of Mexico uh, and fish overnight we've got some cast tackle uh, glow jigs as you can see that sides mostly glow we're gonna drop these at night for grouper and see if we do some good these boats are nice aren't they? yeah so what about are we going on going on this one right here Ooh, yeah. this is crew. solid group of guys right there Look at her muscles. She big girl. She's MVP right here. MVP. What you gonna get? What do you want to catch this trip? Big old AJ. You really? want an amberjack, really? Yeah, big old AJ. Alistair, what do you want this trip? Big gag. So big I gag? Guys, I can throw him right back in. I, yeah, I know. It's <laughs> ridiculous. I'm gonna go scamp grouper. Scamp grouper. Scamp. Yeah. Oh, what's all about like that? Oh, yeah. those species. Okay. Something to eat. Okay. In the quarantine. <laughs> Scamp's good. Scamp, yeah. yeah. Alright guys. Go. Got a nice evening out here. Gonna hit it. an interview point. Yeah. Are you still addicted? I'm completely ruined. <laughs> <laughs> you should ask my fiance that, how she feels about me and fishing. <laughs> Last time I saw you, you were addicted, you're worse now, is that what you said? It gets worse and worse every single day. And every time you get therapy, it gets a little worse. That's exactly right. This isn't helping. This is not going to help. <laughs> I'm trying to light it up. I'm trying to light it up. Yeah. He doesn't use that big light that's glaring behind him. He's over here doing this. <laughs> that's why it's my boy right here, y'all. So we're at the first spot and I can already tell that they're gonna make us work for it. So we'll see how the night prevails. Alright, yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there. Good deal. All right, at this point, I have never seen a spot with so many fish under the boat that would not bite a jig. Uh, they wouldn't even bite cut bait on the bottom. It was insane. The whole the show on this was just ridiculous from like top to bottom. I'm pretty sure everything was on this wreck. But uh, we, we struggled for a while here, but eventually got onto one of the coolest things I've ever experienced. Uh, Kevin's been talking to me for about a year about fishing this spot and drifting cut bait and chumming the water and getting you know yellow tails or these giant mangrove snapper to come up and take it. And he went to the back of the boat and started drifting out some cut bait and pulled in about a five or six pound mangrove snapper. And then from there, we proceeded to probably put 15 to 20 mangrove snapper, you know, between five to 10 pounds in the boat. It was insane. I'd never seen that. I think up to that point, the biggest mangrove snapper I ever saw in person was four pounds. So it turned into a really fun night. Uh, we were stoked. I think everybody on the boat got their PB, which is pretty crazy. Ended up getting into a few of these red snapper as well, which was an awesome fight. And then I managed to catch my personal best mango. Uh, this thing weighed 11 pounds, which is absolutely insane. It's just a slob of a mangrove snapper. Really cool and a great night of fishing. All right, so we're finally getting some sunlight. I didn't film much because it's kind of hard to film in the dark, but uh, I think we have maybe close to like, what would you say, 20 mangoes? The majority yeah. of them being five pounds. We've got some eight pounders, some nine pounders. I caught my PB, I caught 11 pounder in there. It's been an insane night of mangrove snapper fishing. The best I've ever Beautiful. seen. I think everybody on this boat got their personal best mango. It's pretty cool. How tired do we get, right? How the jig boys doing? Just got down. Oh, yeah. Is that what you said? Look, he has already fucking smacked at the first spot. I know, already. We haven't even been fishing two seconds. Already. Already. Oh boy, it's going to be a night. It's going to be a good day. Alistair's already talking smack, guys. Come on, Team Jig. Amico. I'm swallowing. Yeah. Ding, 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 ding. Ding, ding, ding. All right, 
Alright, first rat right here. <laughs> first rat. Alright. That's a good sign. Early in the morning. On a rat. <laughs> it felt so good to get a rat. Sunrise rat. <laughs> it felt so good to get a rat. <laughs> Liner? Mango. Mango. And hey, we're not done with these mangoes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not saying it is, but it doesn't look good. No. Shit. I don't see any on. No. no it's it's a, scam. a scam. It's a decent scam. Nice. That's a keeper scam. That's a keeper scam. That's a keeper scam, bro. Nice scam. Probably the best grouper you can eat in the whole entire ocean right here. Not a giant, but very cool. Check out his green eyes. They're beautiful fish. Very, very cool. Awesome to get it on the jigs. Pulling this fish against the current, so it could be an absolute dink, but feels pretty decent. Beeliner. Who's the fish? Lizard. The biggest lizard fish ever. When it first hit, it acted like it was grown, and now it's really just turned into a pump. It's a stupid, ah, uh, slippery dick, sideways. <laughs> you can't get any more messed up than that. Yeah, it's not a sideways slip. Look at that. Look, it's just spitting over me. You see that thing spit over me though? You're slimy, man. You got some pliers over there. How many grouper have we caught on the jig so far this morning? Like 35. How many? It's this big. <laughs> how did I say, how many have gone in the box? No slots. No but slots. Still fun to get some action, huh? Yeah, I like it, man. Yeah, I like it. We got a believer right here, guys. Yeah, we're converting a bait, guys. New converter. Convert. New converter right here. Yeah. <laughs> Sitting here doing a whole lot of nothing with bait, man. We're catching <laughs> Put a piece of metal on it. Yeah, come give me some of that. Every time we hook a lizard fish on the jig, this thing will eat it on the way up, man. Oh, real salty low, man. You're gonna have to you. get up on the front of the boat. There's another one with it. I don't know if that's a king. That could be something different. It's a king or a who? I think it's a king. Yeah, that's a something else fish. with it. Yeah, there's another one with it. That's a really big one. You're gonna have to go that way with it, buddy. Yeah. That's always eating my lizard can. fish. Try walk back if you can, because find him in the back. Not if you can. This way, right? Yeah, Just turn him that way. Yep, well, he's coming this way right now. That's, that's a big king right there, dude. Here again. Yeah. Well, yeah, he's still. I'm not even. No one got a leader yet. You're close. You got your turn, not. Nice king. Oh, yeah, that's a big king. Bring him back up. Another one behind it. Another one behind it. Yeah, I see him down Watch there. Out. That's what ate my lizard. Yeah, that's a that's a donkey king yeah. right there, dude. Hey. What's up, man? Yeah, that's a donkey king. So after our morning spot, we moved over to a honey hole and just stayed there the rest of the day. Uh, the first drop down for Kevin, he got this giant gag grouper. Uh, really, really cool. And we pulled a ton of big grouper off this spot. You this see first, it yet? Not yet. This is his first yeah, fish, decent though. fish in oh, 20 yeah. fishing trips. Yeah. Let me get the gun. Uh, this is a gag. Probably going to be a gag. I see color. I think it's a gag, guys. No way. I'll let you know in a second. Keep that gap down. Get that mooksy out of here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, superstitious. Why so grumpy? Did you catch it on the head? That's a red grouper. That's red. That's a keeper red. Oh, that is a keeper. Nice. nice. Yeah. Big dog right hey, there. Finally got a good ass bite. This is a good bite, guys. This yeah. Good. This is a real good bite. Would you say it's the biggest lizard fish of the trip so far? <laughs> what the hell? Should we say color? Let it be a scam. So we're gonna be a guessing game. I'm guessing a scam because everybody's catching scams right now. <laughs> That'd be bad. Look at he's peeling drag right now. Is he? Yeah. Look at nice. He's peeling drag. Nice. It's awesome. Been a crazy trip so far, huh? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. fish, fish Mango thing. madness. 25, 25 pound king. 
Big scamp. Big scamps. Yeah, that kid was Big gags. There. Big gags. Yeah. It's kind of wild. I'm gaining a little bit on him. Yeah. Yeah, he's coming. I got color right now. Catching tons of giants on this trip. Check out, uh, check out that red grouper on the jig. Woo! Look at that, guys. That's a good one right there. That will make some good fillets. Dude, awesome. Is that your biggest scamp? Biggest scamp, biggest mango on the trip. Yeah. That's a nice fish. That's insane, dude. Biggest scamp I've seen on this coast. <laughs> that is nuts. Good job, dude. So that pretty much wraps up our day there. You can see we had quite an epic trip. A ton of giant mangoes, some big scamps here, some big red grouper. Uh, giant bee liners. It was a good time with a great group of people and just very lucky and fortunate to be able to go out and fish on the Gulf of Mexico like this and bring this back home for the weekly groceries. So as always, I appreciate you guys watching my videos. Thanks for tuning in. Tight lines.